Welcome back to the channel and thank you for joining me in our little adventure here in Satisfactory guys. This will be episode 11. We'll continue exactly from where we left off in the previous one when I got it. I hope you guys will enjoy this one. Perfect. We'll enjoy it. We'll go with the constructors in the back. Amazing. And the... Uh, I don't know, the rest of the machine in the front. Don't forget our pipes are on that end. So we're gonna come with the pipes in there. Hide them out. And push them into our assemblers. Making all those taters. And that's about it because the rotors are not gonna be made in here. We're gonna make them further away. Actually. Actually. That criterion comes from there. I could snatch, well, well, double the production, coming here with, I don't know, four constructors, making that criterion, bring the pipes on the middle, in there. I mean, use this space in here to make the wire, use that space in there to make the quick wire, send them both in there, splitting those pipes. On this side, for example, I will make the stators. On that side, for example, I'll make my rotors. Life will be just beautiful, you know. So, oh, I forgot. 16, we need it. Blueprints. By the way, these guys, you can put them on your hotbar. Uh, I saved them in undefined. I don't know why. Easy, okay? Drag and drop. Come here, put them here. Come here, put them here. I mean, satisfactory is just, just so satisfactory, amazing. Okay, apply changes, that's it, you got me here. Next time, we're gonna do our, um, whatchamacallit, smelters. So, I wanna leave my space, myself, some space in here to walk by. I'm gonna leave a tile. Okay, so a tile in here, a tile in there. Guess what? We have eight constructors made. Just like that. Easy busy lemon squeezy. My life just have has become a lot easier. Uh blueprints. 16 I said, right? Come in here. You got the line. All you gotta watch is that goddamn arrow. If you cannot make it because you cannot make it, you put it like that. Look at what is written on the screen. Okay, lock hologram, it's H. You press the goddamn H. Uh, you don't hit escape like an idiot. Okay, so. <laughs> uh, you misplaced it, okay? You don't know where it is. Instead of building it in there. <laughs> it was a mistake. Uh, dismantle blueprint. That's very good. You know that we didn't have that one in the first time? So you press H, and after that, you can walk away. <laughs> and with arrow keys, you can nudge this guy wherever you need. Bring it closer, bring it further away, however you want. So, come in here. Look at this. Is it the line? No. More to the right, mister. Oh, perfect. Hey, what do we have in here? Perfection. That's what we got in here. Left click done now all you gotta do is connect this one to this one take that goddamn mark to build put it in there i should have built the mark free by the way <laughs> because we need the mark free but even so it's not difficult let's turn on the goddamn light uh let's go in here make this one mark free i don't know the one up top if we are going to be able to transfer Port on that wire, but that's a totally different story. So, I want this one to be marked. Ring. Come on, baby, work. With me. Thank you. Good stuff. I want to get up. And I'll make this one a mark. Perfect. 
No one death one. Well uh, I wanna leave myself some space to walk around, you know? Good. Now we need some power up here. I think we should really, really look at that power situation. Because I got a feeling we're gonna run out of power really soon. <laughs> get in there. We get in there really fast. Okay, now if you would have flight mode with the flame jiggy uh, unlocked. It would be ideal to see the recipe, if not, we're gonna have to walk to each one of these. And see here, wire. Now, looking at this, we put down 16. Okay, we're making 30. That's 480 wire output. We will not be able to transport with our belt. So, we're gonna have... Come on, baby. We're gonna have to separate the production, but it's fine. It's fine. I'm telling you, it's fine. We're gonna leave it like that. See exactly how much wire we have to do, how much cable, and then we will decide what to do with it. For now, everything is gonna be on wire, baby. Finally made it. Uh, we don't have any copper incoming. I wonder why. Hmm, not enough output. Something is wrong in there. Yep. We're gonna have the copper soon enough. So, was this guy finished? Yes, it was. Still rotor. Yeah, guess, guess what I found in here? Guess what I found in here? What do I say about this? Uh, that's all that I ever wanted. I'm not even gonna scan. Uh, actually, I would like to have it done with quick wire. So we're gonna scan another one. Scan, please. Thank you. Okay. Good stuff. So we're gonna make. A bunch of that. Mm -hmm. Now let's see what, what are we gonna do with it. So we're gonna have to make rotors and stators. Now why did I put this on? So let's say that this guy is making steel rollers and this guy is making stators. Uh, we don't care so much about the steel pipes, apparently they're not evenly spread in. We care a lot about the number that they put in. So I want 10 molars for myself, okay? That will be what, 80 wire and uh, 60 wire, so that's 140 wire out of this production 140 okay after that we will need to make that automatic goddamn wire so 
so for five per minute we're gonna need five staters oh that's another 40 uh so wait uh 40 with 30 means 70 so minus 140 okay because i want 10 moles five of this five of this at some point uh after that we need in here five per minute why five i don't know it's a good number whatever it's a full assembler so that will be a hundred cable and another 40 wire so if i make minus 40 i'm left with 300 wire made but i need in here 50 cable come here cable uh 50 so 25 that's gonna be another 100 wire I got free hand. So I think we're sitting pretty good with the production that we have in here. Now it's time to see what the hell are we gonna do with it. So we need a hundred cable, okay? Let's take care of damaging it real fast. That's I think I did something wrong. We're gonna need a hundred cable in here i'm making 25 so that's multiplied with four we got 200 nevertheless our excess was 300 so we're still gonna have an excess of 100 wire that's very good we're gonna need the 100 cable okay that's uh 200 wire right i think so okay time to pick 200 wire out of here 30 that's seven of them jesus christ what an ugly number ah don't like this seven okay let's take seven two four six eight that bill has to go away uh actually it doesn't have to go away no it doesn't have to. in here let me get up Let's put a small split on it. Uh, and we're gonna see like this. The right side. You're gonna put cable. No, you're gonna put wire. And ahead you're gonna put your... Thank you very much. We... Are going to need 200 in order to make 100 if I'm not mistaken kind of tidy don't have to skip so you need four times this four times this 200 that's a mark three belt that we're gonna bring from there in here in a somewhat beautiful way maybe closer because I want to put a lift on it. Gonna need the mark free lift. Spitting everything in here. Of course, I'm missing goddamn steel beams. Give me those. In here we're gonna need to have a hundred so that's four constructors right um yep 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 four constructors coming up Blueprints. Mark free, because that's what we require. Uh, that one. 
it's in the middle of things he will have to go away we're gonna move it in here just to be sure that we didn't last the goddamn recipe paste it in there okay now we're gonna need four constructors mark three not to be ag four please mark three online with the others scooch them in here because i want them in the middle the other one is the entry point uh set the one in the middle perfect grab that bring it up here and from there bring it in here How come it's not straight? What's wrong with it? I think it was the point of view. Anyway, in here, we're gonna make our cables. Copy, paste. Uh, I didn't do it properly, right? Right, because each one gotta make 25. So, copy. Paste. Paste, paste. Good stuff, giving that power. They will start making that 100 cable so we solved this issue here okay we get the 100 cable that 100 cable will be needed for the automated wiring guess what that will be done with stators so we're gonna need two of this with stators okay now uh let me see about the calculation that we had here so we are making 480 but right now uh we are taking 200 so we remain with 280 in there. Mark 3 is gonna be enough. I think so. Let's double check that. 2, 4, 6, 8. So we have 8 of them. Come on, baby. Uh, making too far 240. That's enough for our belt. It's very good. I like it. I don't know why that guy doesn't get a copper ingot, but we'll check it out in a minute. 240 wire perfect so until here we covered uh there's an excess of 40 wire going forward in here again on copper ingots two four six eight so that's another 240 with that 40 we get 280 that's an issue because our belt can only cover 270 yeah but it is what it is let's see what the hell is going on with that copper it's not coming properly here oh we only now getting copper boys and girls of course because that one has started producing the 240 but it's coming down slowly i don't think it's still producing 240 That one doesn't look like a 240 belt. It could be. It could be. It could be. The ones in the back are getting plugged in there. I see that. Easy. Oh my god. Uh, 
of Chris. Stupid, isn't it? Now that one looks like a 240 bill. Good stuff, another little issue fixed. Gonna take that one as top of the scanner for now. Okay, what exactly do we need today here? We need to make some steel pipes and some wire. Uh, I need 10 rotors and here I need 10 stators and after that I will need another 5 stators. Okay, so I will need 2 times this, 2 times this and another one this. So I'm gonna need 5 assemblers. Put down in here. I'm gonna lay that one in place for now. Uh, my cable exit is gonna happen in here. Uh, let's make it a Mark III because I don't remember what it was. That means, yeah, that one is a Mark III. It's perfect. We're gonna put a little buffer in front of it. Actually, I'm not sure I want to put a buffer in front. Let's leave the buffer aside, put a lookup tower in here and see how exactly we're gonna do this. Uh, through here is the entry point. So our is coming out through there. Those pipes are there. We're gonna need Five of those. Grabbing that wire and that thing. And uh, the exit from two of these will have to come combine with that cable into another one or two assemblers in here. So I think it will be easy to put them start from there. Okay, now, one side will be with pipes, the other side will be with those goddamn wires. Okay, the wires can come in here first, come up there, through here, whatever, doesn't really matter. Uh, and the pipes on the other side. So, let's make, I don't know, this one, the entry point, the second one. Like on this line, is it cool? It's not cool for the others in there. That one is crooked like hell. So I want to redo it. Push it back a little. The same stuff, isn't it? Amazing. Now we have enough place, but you know, those guys are all like perfect. So I said that this will be the second one. Perfect.
when we're gonna have Mark Corbett, I'll have to come in here and make this Delta Mark IV, of course. The one for the wires. Okay, so we're gonna have our pipes in here. Let's make it mark green. Entry point is that okay? Mark three in there. Come on. So if this is the center, one, two, perfect, should be pretty straight, and it is goddamn straight, let's bring the pipes, how many pipes do I have, nothing in that one, we get 9000 in that one. I think the entry point from that one was on the other side. here because remember I need five status for these guys so I want this one actually this will be yeah but I think it's fine it's gonna be just fine so this one is gonna make five status and it's gonna split in two of these guys with this cable here because it's a hundred cable come on jesus christ okay the rest of them will merge and go that way of course some of them will be making stages some of them will be making rollers. Perfect. Uh, I need two of these in there. One and two. Perfect. Let's leave ourselves some space in here. Do I have space in there to work? 
I do. I'm handy. Do stuff. So. One in there. stuff so we have the cables running through here uh, we don't have powers power to those guys and to these guys so maybe we should connect them I said okay let's begin from here yes I want this guy to get filled up first I'm missing cables well oh. not anymore Thank you very much. Good stuff. I already saw my first stator coming up. Our first stator. So this guy gotta make automated wiring. He's gonna get filled up with cables. We're gonna have five automated wiring per minute. It's gonna be just amazing. Let's merge um, on the interior. Let's send them forward. If I would be so kind as to put this one on the middle, that would be just amazing. Man, I left a lot of space. Good stuff. We'll see when that one, where that one will go. Because it will have to get straight in there. But first, it will have to drop down. So, in there is kind of safe. And there is not so safe. <laughs> and then down again to the next floor underneath. In there. And uh, stay in here. And only after that, get in there. What the hell have I done? That one was well placed in here, but with the wrong goddamn recipe. <laughs> uh, no blueprints. Builder, give me an assembler first. Wait to die, guys. Wait to die. So, we were doing this. Maybe we should connect it to some power in here. In there. It is getting filled up. It's amazing. So, these guys will have to go in the rush. Just like our Majigis. And at some point, they'll be synced after that. Really don't care about this belt right now. After what we will have 500 in there. Yeah, I will care about it. In the meantime, uh -uh. good stuff. So I would like to make a storage underneath on this level for all this automated wiring at some point. For now, the same history as with that ugly wire that we just put 
guess what's gonna happen with them. Actually, I'm gonna put it straight in. Oh, still too stick. Okay. Perfect. Amazing. This will be very fast because we only need a hundred in there. After that, I will modify it, bring the belt underneath in here, under this floor, send it uh, up ahead in there, drop it down below on that level. Put I don't know three, four of those in front of it, and that's it. Call it a day. But now we gotta take care of these guys. So. Our pipes are coming, our wire is coming, only in this guy, okay? Apparently not enough for a wire, it's not traveling fast enough. Yeah, 40, and that belt is 60, it's normal. Let's make all this, actually how much does this one take? 40 per minute, this is the same history, okay. All of them will be marked free, because remember, that one should be marked for so I want them to circulate like crazy. This one takes only 10 steel pipes, it's fine. This one takes 15 steel pipes, nevertheless, it's fine for a 60 belt, it's gonna be amazing. Uh, because that one in there is a mark free. So let's connect these boys to the power. They should all start producing, and they should it. perfect. We're gonna empty some of those pipes, this game. Uh, we're making 120, so at this point we have 10 rotors, that's 20, and 15 stators, that's another 45. So 45, 65 we are consuming, not much, I know, but it is what it is. Now. Uh, let's send them that way because in here it's kind of crowded. Oh my god, amazing! Okay, so in here we get the rovers. Let's. Hmm, interesting. How should I do this? Because I have rotors already in here. A thousand. But I don't have stators. I'm making some rotors down below, but I'm not making stators. Not that I will never need them in hand. You know, let's put some boxes in here for them. Further away, just to be able to pick from them if we need them. So, where the goddamn line is? Okay. Oh my 
Good stuff. So we are making the stators in the robots. Now all that we need is to make the motors. We're making five and five. Okay. And then, ten. oh, it's double. I wasn't aware of the fact that it's double. And that's a nasty surprise in there. I was pretty sure it's one on one. Well, I guess we'll not be making 10 molts per minute. We're gonna make only five for now with that goddamn power. Well, it's better than zero, I guess. I would have liked to have more, nevertheless. Uh, I still have to deal with the excess wire, you said? Oh no. Uh, this gas is still not getting the goddamn copper ingots. So something is definitely wrong with that line. They mean the production line. For sure. I gotta go and see what's that about. Uh, nevertheless, we are making five moles per minute. Hmm. That's working just fine. Those are working just fine. So... Yeah, something else is wrong. Okay. Where should we put those Mars? In here maybe? Or maybe in here? I don't know. You could put them in here. The exit point it's around there ish. I could bring a lift down and plug it in here, you know? Just like this one. Yep, I think that's feasible. Let's do that. Perfect. Just take them. Those boxes are not really needed, by the way. Oh, amazing, right through here. It won't bother anything. What about in there? Perfect. Good stuff. All 
already have 51 automated wires uh, and 34 versatile frameworks. Good. Um, I have to think a death storage like yesterday. So, in here we get those plates. I want to have some around here ish. I don't know exactly. Uh, like, it seems tough basically. Let's go into that rock face. We will bring our bajigis in there and then drop them in here and make the storage in here. Out of goddamn iron plates. Can you imagine it? Still got a bunch on the box, gotta get rid of them. I like how it's sinking only one of them. Just amazing if you ask me. So, gotta drop it down in there. Ah, okay. But I come with them um, from there. Yep, until here. Perfect. So, the idea is once that uh, space elevator is filled with our 100 wires. I will delete that. That thing in there, all of it. And that will come with this ones. Merge in the other side, okay? Or, or just from here, I don't know. Not like that. In here. and then drop them down in here. That means I want my storage, oh my god. Okay, ignore anything happened. I want my storage to start from here. And we're gonna need a bunch of those automated wirings. Uh, two of them I think is gonna be just fine for now. No need for more. Uh, give me one of those, please. It's pretty high. I can't believe I dropped it from there. about this stuff so we made 120 more copper we've made the stators and the automated wiring we haven't made that but instead we have five molars per minute which is just amazing it's just amazing so still we need more pipes uh, this one has been fixed actually because right now the rotors are stateless we're doing 
with what we have in here so no need for the brickware at this point uh i think we're gonna need to double all the power and we still need more pipes we need more pipes because we're gonna have to build a lot more than those 8.5 uh, whatever in case beams that we had in there because starting the next year after what all of this stuff in here is gonna be made we will have to make heavy material frames uh, when we gonna unlock that majiggy I'm gonna scan some more hard drives maybe I'm gonna get the best recipe I don't know nevertheless 80% 90% of the recipe if not all of them are using this stuff I mean not this screws this 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 and maybe some wire okay so <laughs> it ain't gonna be pretty in the meantime what I'll need to do um, is troubleshoot all this because it ain't working right in here no mister it ain't we don't have the wire where we need it to be so that one comes in there it splits is go see in there it makes those goddamn cables really good but after that something is wrong something is happening from here on we don't have enough wire for all of this production so something is wrong in there input output i don't know maybe those need to get filled up apparently there now but those are not so yeah this guys just got filled up i don't know we'll look at it we'll see exactly what's going on of course it's gonna take goddamn millennia to get filled up because that one didn't push up 240 in the beginning it's normal i'll keep an eye on it i'll check it i'll make sure it's fine and i'll see you guys into the next one i think into the next one we should play with a little more more blueprints this time for smelters and uh, i don't know what we're gonna do bring a hill in here Jesus Christ, I can't speak. Bring in here that coal for the pipes. Uh, taking another iron ore, just making upgrade one miner. Bring it up here if we have the planes. We'll bring it down there and uh, making more steel pipes because we're gonna need more. We're gonna take a look at this production how it's set up in here maybe I can add more on it by the looks of it I can add another four constructors in there maybe three that space in there I don't think that's gonna be wise with our belts but we'll see because that one is full that one only puts 90 on it it's gonna be pretty interesting to merge it with another belt from there here you know like I'm not sure I want to do that maybe we'll build a new in here on this floor some more steel pipes you know I think it will be the best thing ever nevertheless that will be oh missing concrete what do you know that will be only in the next episode this one is kind of long and you'll have to excuse me for that Thank you guys so much for being here, for watching this. If you like it, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, put a like. I'll see you to the next one. And if by any chance you want to support me on my journey of becoming a full-time content creator, you can do that by grabbing yourselves an amazing membership. Thank you all guys for being here. I'll see you to the next one. Take care of you all.